The Greenville City Council once again addressing a controversial topic tonight, whether to make parking along Evans Street and other lots in Uptown metered. The idea has come under fire from people on each side. WNCT's Josh Birch checking in on the debate. Josh. Blanche, earlier this year, the City Council approved leasing 12 pay for parking stations and eight handheld ticket machines. But many I spoke with say charging for parking in Uptown would be a huge mistake. How can anyone do business down here? There is so much business that has to happen that takes more than two hours. Lack of parking isn't a new problem in Uptown Greenville, but it is becoming more complicated. While not in service, these metered machines have businesses and shoppers worried. If you've got to jump all these hoops and pay all this extra money, they will simply choose to go to Walmart. They will choose to go to, I don't know, Checkers or wherever down the down Greenville Boulevard where people offer free parking. Michelle Jenkins is the owner of Sojourner Whole Earth Provisions, a business she says she struggles to keep open on a daily basis. If people have to pay to park, she says her business likely won't make it. Logan Pace says he'd shop elsewhere. The downtown Greenville is not worth metered parking. Um, I don't even like paying for parking in Raleigh, but at least there it's worth it. During the council meeting, representatives from Greenville Police recommended keeping metered parking where it currently is, but not adding meters to areas like Evans Street. Instead, they'd like to raise the price of parking tickets from $5 to 20 There's a lot of merchants that were quite supportive of this change. The $20 fee would sort of force people to, to, to be consistent with that two-hour brand. Anytime we can, especially in this area, especially on this sort of thing, that we can uh, move very deliberately and make sure everybody knows what's coming. In the end, the council decided to table the topic for a few weeks and keep the status quo on parking in Uptown. But many say they're worried about future actions. Why we're picking on Uptown in this way? Don't understand that. Now, the city could cancel the lease on the pay for parking stations, but they would have to pay for the rest of the fiscal year. That total cost around $21,000. The council also suggested raising parking in current metered lots to $1.25 per hour, but keep it at 75 cents an hour in the garage. Josh Birch, not in your side.